So you're thinking about moving to Gulf Shores, Alabama, Orange Beach, and the surrounding area? Well, today I'm going to walk you through this really, really cute house in Gulf Shores. Uh, we picked this house up for our clients and closed on it for $411,000. It is 2,000 square feet, three bedrooms, two and a half baths with an office. Uh, excellent, excellent pickup. This, um, this is not your average uh, spec home. It, it's not a DR Horton home. It is not a track built home. It, it was uh, actually a lot of really nice finishes, um, beautiful updates. And I can see why my clients picked this house after everything that we looked at. And I know that they are going to love it and it is, it's gonna be a great home for them. I can't wait for you to check it out. So come take a look with us. <music> Hey guys, if this is your first time to the channel, be sure to hit the like button, subscribe button, and ring the little bell so you can be one of the first ones to learn everything there is to know about the current market conditions in Gulf Shores, Orange Beach, and the surrounding areas. My name is Aileen Fountain, along with my partner Andy Hollis and our entire team. We do these videos each and every week just to be informative, just to let you know what it's like to actually live here. So whether it's nine days or 90 days from when you're thinking about making your move, purchasing an investment property, second home, Give us a call, shoot us a text, email us, set up a Zoom. We'd love to meet with you face-to-face. -face. We get calls, texts, and emails from people just like you every single day, and we absolutely love it. So as I mentioned, I um, would love for you to come take this tour with me of this three-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath with an office. Closed on it for 411000 Come check it out. As you enter in, we have the office here to the right. It's gonna have some really nice natural light in there to work from. Single car garage, I'd say that's um, one of the only downfalls to the property but it has a lot of upgrades to make up for it. Some really good storage here up underneath the stairwell. So lots of place for some toys. Nice size living room. And uh, again, some really good natural light. Love the crown, love the uh, casings over the windows. This is definitely not your average um, spec home. So I love how they went all the way to the top with the cabinets, very unusual for our area on, um, on a house this, in this price point. We got a nice half bath here for convenience off the living room and kitchen. Plenty of room there for dining. And I uh, just got a small little patio back here. Um, they may want to extend that at some point. Let's go check out the upstairs. There's three full bedrooms and two full bathrooms up here. Nice wide stair casing and a little landing area here. Love this little nook. You could do, um, you could do a lot with that uh, decorating or sitting area. Nice high ceilings. So right away, this is gonna be the primary bedroom. It's very spacious. And a really, really nice size bathroom, double vanity. Beautiful standalone tub. Again, a lot of nice natural light and uh, Really, really nicely done shower. This almost has a custom feel to it, this house. Nice size uh, closet, private toilet, towel closet here. And 
And there's the view from the primary. They're on a little pond. Ooh, it's a little bright there. A little challenging to see with the sun coming in. So another nice feature is having the laundry room upstairs where the bedrooms are. Uh, super convenient. Something that they should have started doing many years ago in floor plans. Here's one of the guest bedrooms, really good sized guest bedroom. I know the buyers really liked the space that this house provided compared to some of the other things that we looked at, as well as a lot of the nice upgrades and details that this house offered. You can see the casing around the closet. Those aren't your standard doors, so. This bathroom here, you can enter in from the hallway or from the next bedroom, uh, the third guest bedroom. So some nice tub and shower combo. And then here you have another double vanity. So that's nice to have that much space there. And this last bedroom is actually even bigger than the other one. So it's pretty spacious. Beautiful double window there. Nice closet there. Some really good, great space. And here's the neighborhood. There you go. You've got um, County Road 8, also known as the Coastal Highway. Small neighborhood. And uh, one of the really cool features is these beautiful trees and there is a pool. So I'll include a picture of the pool at the end of this video. guys that's going to just about do it for today's video walkthrough of this really cute home in Gulf Shores Alabama uh, we are picking this house up for four hundred and eleven thousand dollars this house is walking distance to the brand new high school that Gulf Shores is building excellent location gold fortified I don't know what else you could ask for for four hundred thousand in such a great location um, young couple buying this house. We looked at a lot of different properties and settled on this one. Uh, we ended up looking at one in Orange Beach that was considerably smaller for not much less money. So I think they got a really good bang for their buck here. We're at 2,000 square feet. House is brand spanking new with a lot of upgrades. Um, in addition to the three bedrooms, they also have an office and she works from home. So that was a really uh, nice feature for them to have. Something that I think that they'll definitely have plenty of years to continue to grow into, which I think this is why this house is going to be an excellent home for them. And I'm so, so excited for them. One of the nicest couples I've ever worked for. Hope you enjoyed this video and until next time, we hope to see you around town.